Hey, if you haven't checked it out already, you should go check out my giveaway video. The link will be down in the description box. In the, 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 the link will be down in the description box below. The giveaway ends on April 16th. So you have like two weeks to go and enter. All you have to do is be subscribed and go comment down below on that giveaway video saying you want to be in it. So Hey guys, today's video is going to be the small YouTuber chat thing. I have the questions and I'm going to enter because I feel I'm a small YouTuber with big dreams and hopes that like maybe one day I would have a community and I figured it fits. If this is your first time seeing my face then go hit that red subscribe button down below for I make new videos every single Saturday and Sunday. Question number one, what inspired you to start making videos? I've already answered the other years on my recent Q&A video so I'll just what inspires me what inspires me pretty much every single time I make a video is that I want to make people happy it's I like doing this I like posting YouTube I like making videos I like making content <laughs> I like making content that people will see and they'll be like oh I like her I'm gonna subscribe to her it's fun. This is a fun community. This is fun to do. Plus, to make someone happy, to find out that you made someone happy or like someone enjoys watching you and it makes them happy or laugh. It's an amazing feeling and it's a feeling that I love and that I adore so much. Question number two. How long have you been on YouTube and how have you had other channels? Well, I've been on YouTube since 2010. I've been on YouTube since 2010. This is my only YouTube channel. I have another channel, but it's just because I have a Gmail and it's linked to the Gmail because Google like bought out YouTube. I don't use that one. I might use it to like videos when I accidentally have it up on my phone instead of this channel. But this is my only YouTube channel. I have only had this one. Like I've tried to turn my other one into another channel but it's linked to my gmail and I use that gmail for school and I'm not really in the mood for a teacher to see it be like whoa next you know they're watching my youtube videos I'm like sitting like this in class like question number three where do you see yourself and your youtube channel in five years in five years I see myself hopefully with a little tiny community or a big community I could dream big and I see myself collabing with a big YouTuber, but I doubt that would probably be true. A girl can dream, can't she? I hope that at the end of 2017, going into 2018, I'll at least have like a little bit of community. But in five years, yeah, I see myself with a community. I see myself with a fan base or a community or however you want to say it. Question number four. What message are you trying to get across with your videos? I guess you could say positivity, hopefulness mainly just to make people laugh like sometimes i make positivity videos sometimes i make funny videos mainly the message i want to say is like to stay hopeful to stay positive to live life with no regrets i should probably rephrase that don't judge it doesn't matter how you are in a, as a person like you could be quiet you could be outgoing you could be shy you could be a loner. You could be someone who stays at home and prefers to stay at home than go out and party with like friends and stuff. So the message I want my channel to get across is to don't let anyone tell you what to do with your life. Like just be yourself. Be someone you want yourself to be. Don't be someone someone else wants you to be. Question number five. Do people from school find your channel? I want to say no. But I mean I have given friends to this YouTube channel. I have giving people in my classes YouTube channel. I have no shame. I'm just a quiet girl. If someone asks me for my YouTube channel, I'm not going to be like, no. Like, you know, I'm going to give you my channel. <laughs> I don't have a shame in the videos I make. It's just, you see another side of me if you want my YouTube channel. My dog is gone. If you want my YouTube channel, you're just going to see another side of me that you don't see in school. Like, in school, I am quiet. I am innocent on this channel. I am out there. I am, like, hyper. I am everything and it's mainly because i put myself out there i just sit at home on the computer like as you can see i'm sitting at home oh by the way my mom painted that 
And I'm just like, this is me. This is truly me. This is me when I don't let anxiety and everything take over. In school, it takes over. Anxiety digs a little hole for me and just lets me in. And I have to be in there for all eight, seven hours of the day. At home, on YouTube, I could be anything. Question number six. What does your username mean? Oh, no. My username is Melissa with Issa in... Well, that's not really my username. That's not my channel name thing. With Issa in, like, parentheses. Because I'm Mel. I'm Mel. And that's that's my name. Or Melon. I would perform myself a Melon on this channel, but I'm Mel. Now, my actual YouTube username, 2010 Webkids Lover. That's another story. That's just me being, like, 12 years old making a little channel like i thought it was cool <laughs> i was a fan of webkins i was a big webkins stand i had like over 200 it was 2010 i guess i just like made a random username like imagine if i had a twitter and i made that make <laughs> like if i had a twitter in 2010 my username probably would have been 2010 webkins level i would be like yeah <laughs> i would have like no shame we don't talk about that <laughs> number seven favorite small youtubers I would say there's not that much. I mainly watch the big YouTubers. I have a few. Now, there's some I find that I don't know the name of, but I do watch them. I just don't watch them frequently enough to know their names. But I know there are some. Number one, Little B Mason. Brianna Mason. Y'all should go watch her. Like, I feel like she's going to be pretty popular like one day like hopefully at the end of this year but like sometime i feel like she is going to be a big channel and the next thing i'm going i put six fingers up. the next thing i'm going to say is they are little accounts if you don't know what little is you should probably join the community the first one is binky princess who is pirate like, i guess you could say i'm not sure if she's actually a small youtuber i think she might actually be going into the big youtubers but like i'll still put a lot here the next one is Cotton Candy Princess, also known as She's Pretty Adorable. You should go check her out. The next one is Baby Girl Zero. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're a small YouTuber too and you want me to check you out, go leave a comment down below and I will definitely go check you out. I love you all so very much and I hope that you guys will be able to come back tomorrow or Saturday or whenever my next video is. And to help that, you should go press the little bell button right next to the subscribe button. I swear you won't regret it.